What up, world? Alright, so uh, my friend the Birch has been asking me to try out Baldur's Gate 3, and I was on the fence, but I asked my sister if she was interested in playing, and she said, yeah, if I, if I get it, she'll play it, but she's not going to buy it herself. So I decided, okay, I'll pick up Baldur's Gate 3, or the hell of it, whatever. So Birch has been asking me to play it. I think somebody else has asked me in the past to play it too, so I got it. We're going to try it out, so let's go. Just gotta do the first time loot real quick. Why is it telling me to open Steam when Steam's already open? Silly. Please update your driver so you'll have the best experience. I, I, I'm I like one or two behind. The, the, the... I mean, it's up to you, but... I mean, I should be fine. I updated it recently. You have what? What card do you have? A 30... 4090. 40... Oh, I have to make an account for this? You do? Uh, I, oh, maybe you do. I don't remember if you did or not. Are you new here? Larian Studios. Great. Steam account. Fucking hate third party launch platforms, they're annoying as it, shit. It's, it's not it's not really a third party though, it's just I mean, it, it is, but it's not. Direct X eleven or Vulcan. I don't know what the fuck Vulcan is, so I'm gonna say direct Vul X. Vulcan, Assuming Vulcan, Vulcan is AMD. It's the newest one. It, it works really well. Um at least on this game it does, but not always. Play. Just have to add the source for this. Sure. Source. No. Transform. Screen. Combat, you can also blah 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 blah, it's skipped. EULA, accept. Scroll all the way down. Show nudity, no. You're allowed to have nudity for. I don't care if I'm allowed to have it, I still don't want to stream it. No, I mean, like, Twitch allows you to stream it. I got that. I don't want to, I don't want to stream it on Twitch. I also upload my VODs over to YouTube. For us, Tate automatically syncs your latest five save games between any platform which you play Baldur's Gate 3. Activate it, but playing on any other uh, platforms. Like, I gotta boost Discord. I always have it at 75% because I'm always playing PUBG. And since yeah, listen. PUBG is uh, so fucking loud, I have to reduce this so I'm not destroying my ears with Discord as well. Best uh, volume in the game. Let's User option show genital show cinematic nudity. There's well, there's 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 not that much. Like I have, I'm in the past act two, and I still haven't came across like nudity or anything like that. It's just the sheer fact that that's an option in there. Act two uh, there's, a, there's a lot of it. 
Oh, great. Firefox is doing an update, which means it's going to open and close itself three times. Nice. That drives me shit, uh, crazy. This window is sure. That adds something to my stream. It contain mature rated game. That's annoying me. Uh, where is the right. toggle off mute sound when inactive? Because I'm constantly going between the windows, so every time I go to the other window, the sound's cutting. A lot of games do that by default. I hate when they do that. <laughs> Worth facing mini map. I don't like when the maps uh, rotate. It gets confusing. Tactician. I guess we'll just go with balanced. Ah, uh, the first time I play a game, I usually just default to wherever the normal setting is. Cutscene. I'm gonna have to fix that. It's saying I'm getting 1,200 FPS. <laughs> Did you turn on DLSS or something? I don't know. I just have to like limit the uh, FPS. Hmm. No reason to go over 240, because that's all my screen's going to show me. Alright, so we got some kind of sorcerer dude in some kind of room. Alien pods or something? I'll be quiet so you can watch that. Playing a DD &D game, or is this supposed to be like some kind of alien covenant? You're playing a DD &D game. Those are just, uh, those are lithioids or mind flayers, whatever you want to call them. Ah, this guy's playing with some kind of, I'm assuming this is like some kind of earworm. Wait, was this the thing from that, uh, the DD &D movie where the guy had the worm put in his head and it, like, had it controlled him? Yes, sir. Oh, dear God, that's disgusting. It just crawled in her eye. Yes, sir. This could still look like a motherfucker right here. Alright. And Ex Machina? Nope. Uh, my eye just got bit. Unless that's not my point of view, I don't know yet. I haven't even made a character or anything. Enable tutorials. Who are you? I guess I, I would. Keep there's that a on. lot. Yeah, there's a lot. Who are you? Origin, custom, origin characters. I mean, I should probably, like, read through all this shit. Let's see, it's long sword, short sword. Short bow. Dark vision, you can see in the dark up to 12. I saw some kind of meme on Reddit, I think, about uh, people playing D&D &D and the Dungeon Master going over the character sheets and, like, literally everybody had this dark vision thing. It dark visions it's pretty big but like there's if you have a character that has it you i mean and you can cast light you can use a torch i mean there's 
Tiefling just looks like a, an Eridar from World of Warcraft. Well, I guess an Eridar would look like a Tiefling then, because, wow, well, okay, <laughs> yeah, this is been, yeah, it's, yeah, it's been out a hell of a lot longer then. Have resistance to fire damage, taking only half damage from it. Drows or Dark Elves. I remember uh, a long series of books back when I was at the bookstore about um, some kind of drow guy. I'm trying to remember what his name was. He was like a prominent D&D character or something. Drizz, I think? Drizzt? Is that it? Mm, maybe. Sounds right. Superior dark vision can see up to 24 meters. Guess and gets Yankee or orcs. No, there are actual orcs. I see half orc. Seen all skills of a chosen ability. Chant creates an invisible spectral hand that can manipulate and interact. Boots are made for what? That shows what they'll do. And none of these boots are. Wait, fuck it up. Fucked it up. Hey, up, baby, you have girlfriend in Vietnam? Just watched that movie the other night, actually. Not for the first time, I've seen it quite a few times. Dragonborn! Fus Rota! Dragonborn get no special effects, just uh, base racial speed. Uh, you also get Breathe Fire, or whatever, based off of whatever you go. I just know that from D&D, so like, I, I haven't even picked it yet, but pretty sure you'll get that. Elves are the only ones that have proficiency with longsword and short sword. I don't see anything for two handed swords, though. A human versatility is select an additional skill to be proficient in. Can I choose swords as that, or. Let's say that again? Human versatility is select an additional skill to be proficient in. Your carrying capacity is increased yes, by. So when I can choose a sword for that? Yes. Okay, then I'm going to go with human. You can choose whatever you want. I mean, I, I... Yeah. I mean, like, make the character you want. I'm not going to, like, tell you what you can or cannot do. Like, I was it's... just asking if I can go with swords with that. You you probably already... You might even be efficient. Depending on the class and stuff you go, you might already be proficient with swords. It just depends on what kind of sword. There's long swords, short swords, rapiers... Uh, halberds, there's like, and each one requires a different proficiency. Now, you can use any weapon, whether you're proficient in it will unlock different stuff and you'll do more damage. And be a bard and hump everything that everything that does and doesn't move. I absolutely can. Isn't that why people play bards in this game? <laughs> Set the whole fucking meme. Like, well, it, it's just because, bard. yeah, it's just, it's just because of, uh, yeah. I'm just gonna go with fighter, I think. I 
do I want to go two-handed weapon or do I want to go dual? Hope the locals are friendly. Hells. Be wary. It's opened. More of those wretched things. There's magic keep. Where to next? Let's hope the locals are friendly. Like normally when I change 